Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import 500 plus free HDRI guys into your Unreal Engine 5.0.1. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. You look at the final outcome. This is the HDRI with panorama sphere. You play, and you can see once you enter it, it is a panorama sphere and actually you will be at, at the center right so just have a look this one actually you can make it bigger it is like a surrounding environment <coughs> all right how are we going to import all of this so start from now, I'm going to close, close this project and then you can go to my video description. The first link is get the HD, HDRI from Polyhaven. <coughs> Click into this link in the video description. Right, next I'm going to to the website there. Once you click in, it is going into the Polyhaven HDRI. So what you are going to do is just to save it. But before that, in your Unreal Engine 5, I start a demo from here. I launch it and start a new game project. So that you will know step by step how, how are we going to do from the beginning. Okay, this is the Unreal Engine 5. I'm going to create a new game project. That is the third person game created. <coughs> now the third person game is loading. Just wait for a while. Okay, this is a new new project file. If you try to play this is a, a new game project. Right, so how are we going to import the HDRI from, from that website? Right, you can scroll down, go to my video description, go and download the Panorama Sphere FBX. This is just a, a sphere. Once you download it already, as demo, I will put it on my desktop. Panorama Sphere. Next, in your content folder, just right click create a new folder hdri underscore sky right double click in then the panorama sphere fbx drag in to import it then click import all next what you are going to do is go and set the condition double click <coughs> scroll down the collision it is here, the collision preset, complexity. The collision, it, it is automatically blocked or you can just make it become no collision so that you can penetrate in and penetrate out. Or you can just set it block all and here use the complex collision. But as that more, I will just use no collision. It is simple, safe and close. Next, drag the panorama sphere out. Just drag it out. Then now you can see it is quite dark. If you try to play play your game, once you enter, it is quite dark. So you can just put some light inside here. At the beginning, there, there's no play sector. You have to just go to go to the window, play sector. And here you can choose the light. So I'm going to put a put a light here, a spotlight. Sorry, I'll put a point light here. So that, so that everything will be brighter. Okay. The intensity, I put it until 10. It will be brighter. Next, in your HDRI, here, I'm going to download a simple one. For example, this. I click in, and then, 
just go to here go and download download the 8k to map to jpg once you click it is going to load at there then you are going to save it into your computer this is the, the sky this is a hdri and this is actually the texture of the 360 degree sphere panorama <coughs> so now once it loaded finish i right click save image as i will save it on my desktop this is a j gray park jpg save it now it will be here once it finished download all right once finished already it is very simple in your unreal engine 5 you are going to just drag in to import it drag in here this is a jpg file it can be a texture so i drag and drop into here and wait for a while <coughs> now i try to play my game you can see once i en enter this scene it already become a panorama see it is really really easy to do All right i press press escape i may change change the light the light's position and this one I can make it bigger and the light the light intensity I may just want to make it brighter maybe 50 right or 100 right now I try to play again once I enter you can see it is like a surrounding sky press escape in one thousand five hundred right next And this this guy I may just want to make it make it bigger. Like this. Okay, this one I, I will put it at the center. It will be better. Now I try try to play again. This one I, I delete it. Okay, I will keep it. I play. Now you can see this is really a 360 degree panorama. You can make it as, as big as possible. We try try to check the lights here. The point light we may put more to make it brighter. Play. Now you can see it is really awesome. A 360 degree panorama. Now no collision so that you can come out anytime. Right. That's all for today about how to import all the free HDRI sky from from the Polyhaven into Unreal Engine 5.0.1 to make it part of the assets in your Unreal Engine 5 game project. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you will receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy animation and game developing. See you!